This video contains really big spoilers for The Last Jedi, so watch at your own risk. Hello, and welcome back to Vlog Thing. Uh. <coughs> 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 ah. Now, with more. <coughs> broken lungs. No, welcome back to Vlog Things, everyone. Uh, this is gonna be a string of random vlogs that I'm gonna make where I'm slightly off center of the camera. But no, welcome. Uh, today I'm gonna be discussing The Last Jedi. Yes, because that was a thing. I watched The Last Jedi uh, last week. I think it was um, Saturday, I believe. It was the day before uh, New Year's. Or not New Year's, what am I saying? Uh, the day before Christmas Eve. And I have to say, I have a few criticisms about it. But uh, before we start, spoilers. Spoilers everywhere. This isn't going to be a spoiler filled uh, vlog, so I'm going to put that in the description and in the, the title. This will contain spoilers, so don't get your, your panties in a twist or whatever, however you say it. Um, yeah. First of all, amazing movie. Screenplay was amazing. The cast was amazing. I especially love the new ones that got brought in this time. Uh, but, like I said, I do have a few criticisms. I can't even talk myself. I don't know why I'm criticizing this movie. Um, and before I start this, taking the note that I'm not a professional critic. I am a fifth, or I do not know my age. I am a 16 year old guy who watches Star Wars a lot. That's about all I have on my resume at this point. I don't, I don't, I can't make criticisms, but this is my opinion. You may have a different opinion. That's totally all right. We're all human. We're all different. You know the point. Why can't we be friends? Why can't... Okay. Uh, so, first criticism. It did have quite a few curse words. And I know that's not a big thing nowadays. But, you know, watch, going from uh, Star Wars, which it really starts on 4. But it stars 4 all the way to Star Wars, The Last Jedi. I'm not going to name them all. I'm not that smart. But, <coughs> I mean, it started off with... Damn, that was about it. That's the only, like, they would say something like that or really quick and it would be muffled to where you can't hear it. But you can clearly hear in this movie, like, mm, I count about four or five, because I'm, I'm very keen on that, because uh, I'm not used to it. Um, I counted, like, the, the damn, which isn't really a curse word in my book, but, I mean, it is kind of in a, in a Star Wars movie. They did say the B word, um... Which I'm not gonna say, cause it's... <laughs> Ooh. Um, yeah, they just said that once. Uh, they said other curse words, but it was kind of fast, but... Yeah, it was at a point where Finn and the silver one, I don't know the name of her, of her cause I know it's a her, but... Uh, where, um... Uh, he's about to be beheaded by the Executioner, which I actually have an ornament of. Uh, which I'm actually going to show you guys. Hold on, give me a second. So yeah, this is uh, an ornament my grandmother gave me. It's uh, really nice, actually. Um, yeah, it's an ornament. Very nice quality ornament. As you can see in the front is a stormtrooper. In the back is the butt of a stormtrooper. On the side is Rey and all the other characters like Finn. So yeah, other than that, I only have a few more criticisms of the movie. That came out really wrong. I, few, I have only a few more criticisms of the movie. One is that Luke died. I mean, like I said, spoilers. Spoilers. I have it everywhere, so if you don't listen to that, then that's your fault. Um, but I mean, the way he, he died was okay. I mean, uh, um, it was a Jedi death, which was pretty cool. But if you weren't like an avid watcher of Star Wars movies... You wouldn't really understand what happened because the same thing happened to Luke Skywalker that happened with Obi-Wan, except it was kind of different. Well, the way I didn't understand, he was um, fighting Kylo Ren in the, the planet, the little rebel base, uh, and Kylo Ren finds out he can't kill him because he's, he's one with the Force at this point, and he puts a lightsaber to him, and he goes, see you later, kid, and he disappears. Now, for me, I understood what happened because he accepted his fate and he just kind of became one with the Force. But did that happen with Obi-Wan? Because 
Obi-Wan was killed by Darth Vader. He was chopped. And he disappeared. But Luke didn't have any damage inflicted to him. So did he just like become one with the Force and just like, I accept it and just vanished? I mean, maybe I don't understand Star Wars that well. Maybe you guys can explain to me. That would be great if you can explain that. That would be awesome. But I didn't really understand that part. I thought he was going to go out like a like Jedi. After all, the lasers shot him from the um, the ATs or whatever you call those suckers. He got blown up the smithereens. And then you see him. He's like, just standing there. He's like, hey. And I thought that was pretty neat. And I thought, man, like, he's going to, there going to be lightsaber to lightsaber. Crashing with lightsabers, dueling, dueling. And all of a sudden, he slips and just shot his, just, Bye bye, Luke. I thought this was gonna happen, but I guess it was kind of symbolic in some way. So yeah, it would have been cool to see him go out like uh, Han Solo in The Force Awakens, uh, being killed by his apprentice, or in Han's case, his son. But you know, other than that, nothing really. My third and final critique with the movie is a very small piece, but it kind of ties the whole story together. The Master Codebreaker. It seemed unnecessary, although it had to be done to move the story along. How were they going to break into the route to the? Uh, no, they, they destroyed the dreadnought, um, the imperial new order thing, uh, and then put down the uh, the uh, tracker or whatever because they could track them through light speed. Uh, but whatever, um, it seemed unnecessary. It seemed like a character that kind of didn't need to be put there. Um, but he did make me feel a lot of feelings because I, at first I was like, oh, he's a mean guy. And then he gave back the medallion to the girl. And then he he was like, oh, I didn't do this all along. And I was just tricking you. And I was like, oh, okay. So he's a nice guy in the long run. He's just always drunk. And then uh, and then he kind of turned against him. And I was like, ah, you, that was it. I thought whenever the, uh, whenever the AT, I don't know I'm probably saying this wrong, the AT, AT or whatever, the big, the big walker things started shooting everyone in the hangar bay, I was like, oh shoot, maybe it's the guy, maybe he turned his ways, and maybe he was doing it all along. Uh, no, it was BB-8. But, uh, <laughs> he just kind of seemed unnecessary in a little side character that may or may not be, may or may not be put in the Cyclopedia of Star Wars. It's up for grabs, really, whether you like him or not. But, uh, and that, the movie was great. I would rate it a 9. 0.5 out of 10 because the very small things I would change about it, but I'm not George Lucas. I'm not Disney. I don't freaking know. So yeah, uh, I would like to hear you guys, your, you guys, criticism. Yes, I am country. I'd like to hear you guys, criti I'd like to hear your criticisms in the comment section below. Uh, and if you did enjoy this video, you can like it if you want. Uh, and if you do like my channel, feel free, feel free to subscribe. So yeah. I'll see you in the next one. I I don't have an original out. out hey guys, I'm sorry. I hope you enjoyed that video. Uh, I do put a lot of work and effort into these videos. It may not look like it, but I do. Uh, probably about two hours of editing each. Uh, just making sure everything's coherent and the music loops perfectly and uh, everything really just flows together. Um, so if you would like, please, please do leave a like. Um, only if you want to though, um, if you do like my channel, feel free to subscribe. Uh, everything I do here is ad free. Uh, it is user friendly, so you can watch this with the family. Uh, so just feel free. Um, hope you guys enjoy and I'll see you guys in the next video. See ya.